And we are finally at number one on this top 50 video game franchises that need to make a return, that need to be revived. This has been a long series of videos. The first time I've ever done a list this big, it took me a couple months to get this whole list all recorded. And we're finally at number one. 50 games. I did about 15 honorable mentions. When I put this list together, it was about like 90, 80 something franchises. So obviously some honorable mentions didn't make the full list. But we're finally at number one. We are finally at number one. And if you know a single thing about me, and one franchise above all else that I have advocated for since forever that I've wanted to see make a comeback and see make a return and I know everybody else has pretty much said the same thing too because I've said that for numerous games in this series, in this list that there are numerous game franchises that online when people have polls, when people ask questions about what game franchises you want to see make a comeback there's always those select few that always, always, always always get a mention in this number one franchise is sure as hell that and this list was done like months ago probably at the beginning of the year like probably around february or march was when i originally put this list together which i mentioned that like in the metal gear video i mentioned that in a few other videos that some stuff was announced and some stuff came after it but some of that stuff like remakes remasters and so on and so forth so on and so forth don't really count in my book they're not full-fledged returns full-fledged revivals but this franchise has recently had, well before I did this list, because it's not on the paper I have written right there, but as recently, as of a Nintendo Direct recently, has had some form of new content released for it. Not fully new, but newish enough that they had to put it together and make something new for it to even work, and it's not just a retread of an old game. It is a Nintendo franchise. You should know exactly what it is, because if you have not seen it on this list at all yet, you know for a fact, because of who I am and the stuff I've mentioned, it's going to be on this list somewhere. And number one on this list of top 50 video game franchises I feel deserves to make a comeback is none other than F-Zero. F-Zero is number one, the Nintendo futuristic racing vehicular combat game that debuted the same year I was born, 1990. It's been around for 33 years. We recently saw F-Zero 99 as a freaking Battle Royale game for Switch Online. And people are still waiting for a new, full-fledged, completely new F-Zero and have been waiting since 2003 for consoles and 2004 for handhelds. F-Zero Climax, F-Zero GP, or GX, GP Legend, GX, Climax, two Game Boy Advance games, one GameCube game. And we have not had one since. And everyone has been asking for it since the Wii, since the DS, since the 3DS, since the Wii U. Now on Switch, four generations later... <laughs> Well, let me see. Four, five, eight, eight, eight. Three generations later, the Switch, <laughs> the Wii in DS, the Wii U in 3DS, and the Switch. Ninth generation. We haven't seen one since the sixth generation. And this has been one of like those franchises that are like not the most popular, well-known franchise from Nintendo, but it definitely has history. Dating back in 1990, the first one came out on Super Nintendo. Then Satel of You in Japan got like BS of Zero Grand Prix 1 and 2 in like 1997. There was a gap there with F-Zero X and the N64 in 98. Maximum Velocity on the Game Boy Advance in 2001. GX on the GameCube in 2003. AX, which was an arcade version of GX. GP Legend on the Game Boy Advance in 2003. Climax on the Game Boy Advance in 2003. There was a GP Legend anime. Obviously, cameos for the franchise with various content in Smash Brothers and Mario Kart. Freaking, it was the franchise that pretty much Nintendo built Mode 7 off of on the Super Nintendo. And, all, and then now various games came back on Switch Online. You could play X and you could play Super, you could play the Super Nintendo Original and you could play Maximum Velocity. Eventually, I'm hoping you could play Climax and RKAX and 
freaking GP Legend and whatnot. There's been so much content back then, but we have not seen any legitimate full-fledged new content since 2004 until F-099. Now, when you sit down and you think about it, is F-099, I see it being two, it represents two different things. One, they're using it to gauge people's interest in bringing F-Zero back, which they should have expected that because for years people have been asking for F-Zero. Some guy literally paid money to get into an interview and ask them, from someone from Nintendo, where is F-Zero? <laughs> people have been asking it for years. But I do think 99 could either be A, it's gauging interest in the franchise to bring a new game back, which could either be closing out the Wii this generation, or it could be a debut game, a launch game for their 10th generation system, or B, they have something planned, they're working on a new game, and this is just being used to tide us over. There has to be a reason for it. We haven't seen anything even remotely new for F-Zero in forever, and even though F-Zero 99 isn't a full-fledged new game, it's something that actually had to have effort to be put into it to make it work. F-Zero is the number one franchise I want to see come back. F-Zero is the number one franchise I want to see revived. And I know a lot of people agree with me. I know a lot of gamers out there. I know all of you agree with me. Even if it's not your number one, it's on your top ten. There's a lot of gamers out there that want to see the return of F-Zero and don't want it to be relegated only to extra content in Mario Kart and for Captain Falcon and music and whatnot to be in Smash Brothers. We want to see a full-fledged new F-Zero, a revival of the franchise to continue it forward. And that's why it's my number one. Now, put, with that being said, put in the comment section what you guys think. Do you guys want to see F-Zero come back? Do you agree with me having it number one? Should it be lower? Is it fine where it's at? How much do you want to see it come back? If you do, put in the comment section down below. Thank you all for watching this list. I know it's been a few months since I started this and I haven't finished it yet. I know obviously a lot of people that seen this list back on Facebook and Twitter have known the entries for months. But you on YouTube have been watching this entire time all the way through. And I thank you all for watching it. My first ever big list like this. And I can guarantee you it won't be my last. I am going to take a small break, go back to my normal top 10s and other YouTube videos before I do another top whatever the hell born 10. But I guarantee you, it's coming. There will be more. And thank you all for watching. Discuss it down below. My name is Snipers1. Peace. Please subscribe if you want to have a lovely day. And see you all later in the next video. Falcon. Pong!